Hello friends, welcome to another part of Panasonic Robot Training How to use the Teach Pendant This is the part 9 Here we discuss register teaching points Register teaching points in a file When you register a teaching point Data of the robot orientation and the travel method Interpolation, travel speed etc are registered at the same time The interpolation and travel method registered in the teaching point are the travel method from the preceding teaching point teaching point to the current teaching point first either create a new file or open an existing file second with jog up down operation move the cursor to the line just before the line in which you would like to register the teaching point make sure the edit type icon on the menu bar is set to add fourth turn on the robot motion icon to get the robot operational the move command to be inserted in is displayed in at the bottom of the screen interpolation travel speed and weld air cut setting data of the teaching point is displayed fifth move the robot to the position you would like to register friends here you can see the diagrammatical view of this register teaching point here you can see teaching point travel method interpolation speed etc all information is stored with each teaching point you can see here click edit type add if you are creating a new file it is set to add automatically you can also see this image here you can see add make one robot begin of program end of program robot motion move p p001 10.00 meter per minute this line is added this red arrow indicates line added now sixth is if the travel method interpolation and speed displayed at the bottom of the screen is what you want press enter key to register the teaching point next is if you want to change the travel method of the teaching point press r shift key then function icons are changed to those for travel method with the function icons change the travel method as you like as you change the travel method of the teaching point the display at the bottom of the screen changes then press enter key to register note the travel method is displayed at the bottom of the screen while r shift key is held down the display is cleared once the key is released here you can see the image in this image we can see teaching items interpolation travel speed and weld air cut in this you can also see make one robot begin of program tool move p end of program and some function icons now next is if you want to change the contents of a registered teaching point turn off the robot motion icon then move the cursor to the line of the teaching point you would like to edit and click the jog dial then the contents of the teaching point id displayed change the data and click ok button to update the teaching point in this image you can see the item interpolate air cut weld position name manual speed cl smooth level contents move l weld p 10 meter per minute cl is equal to zero default window change key switches the active cursor move l p 10 meter per minute ok cancel now interpolate specifies an interpolation from a previous teaching point to the current teaching point teaching point to be registered air cut weld select weld if the current teaching point to the next teaching point is welding section otherwise select air cut position name specifies a position variable of the current teaching point manual speed specifies a robot travel speed from the previous teaching point to the current teaching point wrist calculation normally set zero in case of a special calculation set one two three or four this field is not available if the teaching point is move p a smooth level normally set default if you want to change a smooth level for each move command select table from zero to ten the default settings is six standard smooth level for details of smooth level refer to section 10.10 smooth level on page 122 now if you want to specify the move command before registering a teaching point while holding down the r shift key press the enter key then the move command setting dialog box is displayed complete the setting items and then register the teaching point note use the teach advanced settings more and this symbol to specify whether to display the move command setting dialog box at the time of registering a teaching point normally it is set to display the move command setting dialog box if both r shift key and the enter key are pressed to register a teaching point if only the enter key is used to register a teaching point the move command setting dialog box won't be displayed now next is changing teaching points First, open the file and then move the cursor to the teaching point you want to make position change. Second, make sure the edit type icon on the menu bar is set to change. 
third turn on the robot motion icon and move the robot to the new position you want change to fourth press the enter key then the confirmation message is displayed click yes to update the robot position data note this operation position change of a dot point is not available when the robot motion icon is off you can see all this procedure in this image you can see this image here change function icon and program positioned change now next is registration of teaching point deletion first open the file and then move the cursor to the teaching point you want to delete all this procedure you can see in this image here you can see the delete icon second make sure that edit type icon on the menu bar is set to delete third press the enter key then the teach pendant promotes you to confirm the deletion of the robot position click ok button to delete it note this operation deletion of a dot point is executed whether the robot motion icon on or not now next is move commands for each interpolation welding robots move command move p interpolation type ptp move l interpolation type linear move c circular move lw linear weaving move cw circular weaving weaving amplitude point is registered as view p maximum speed the maximum speed is common to ta and tb manipulators which is 180 meter per minute next how to switch the manual speed the manual speed is the travel speed of the tool center point welding point in operation use the function key to change the speed all this how to switch the manual speed procedure you can see in this image first open the program and click the r shift key to display manual speed icon second click the icon and switch the speed ranges high middle and low now next is wrist calculation cl number here two columns are given cl hashtag calculation application you can see this image of wrist tool vector tztx0 automatically calculate the wrist interpolation based on the torch direction one for circular interpolation use it when the tool vector is nearly perpendicular to the circular plane tolerance with 10 degrees second for circular interpolation use it when the tool vector is not perpendicular to the circular plane tolerance 10 degrees or more third to avoid singular orientation use it when the bw axis is a singular orientation with nearly zero degree that is tw axis and rw axis are parallel it can avoid singular orientation however since joint angles of rw bw and tw axis are allocated equangularly trajectory of the tool center point line want to be straight line therefore it is necessary to teach points close to each other please note that it may not be possible to maintain tool orientation constant star one it calculates the wrist interpolation after allotting the uvw parameter which represents torch angle between teaching points next differences between cl hashtag 0 and cl hashtag 4 cl hashtag 4 is calculated by allotting the torch angle therefore in boxing welding at a corner welding operation is executed while keeping the torch angle v the angle from the vertical surface c the right figure boxing welding process cl hashtag 0 and cl hashtag 4 you can see in this image in this image you can see torch angle v cl hashtag 4 keeps this angle while welding movement of cl hashtag 4 movement of cl hashtag 0 travel the shortest path in general it is better to use cl hashtag 4 for corner fillet welding than cl hashtag 0 depending on positions of dot points interpolation type cooperative movement or so on cl hashtag 0 could be more suitable than cl hashtag 4 check the performance of both cl hashtag 0 and cl hashtag 4 using trace operation and see which cl number is suitable to your application so friends further topics we discuss in our next video Till then, stay safe and take care.